Hello everyone once again welcome back to all about mathematics if you like our content don't forget to like share and subscribe our channel so aaj ke is video mein hum june 2022 mein puche hue integral equation ke part b ke question ko discuss karne wale hain so let's start with the question question says that for any two continuous function f g such that r to r defined by f dot g t equals to integration from 0 to t f s g t minus s d s which of the following value of f star g t when f of t is equals to exponential minus t and g of t is equals to sin of t then we have to find which of the following option is correct here so first of all as this one is given here f dot gt and we have to find value of f dot gt here so as this one here if we replace value f dot gt can be written as here integration from 0 to t exponential minus t this one is value of f of s so as here this one will be f exponential minus s here and dot since this one is g of t so g of t minus s can be written as here sin of t minus s here dot sin of t minus s here into d of s here we have to integrate this one with respect to s here so by simplifying this as we know that sin t minus s can be written as here sin sin a minus b can be written as here sin a cos b minus of cos a sin b here so agar hum yahan se iski value substitute kar de so f dot gt f dot gt ki value hamare paas yahan se aa jayegi integration from 0 to as here integration from 0 to t here exponential minus s exponential minus s and by substituting value of exponential t minus s here we can write it as a sin t cos s minus sin cos t sin s into ds so by simplifying this we can write it as here since we have to integrate this one with respect to s here so this can be written as a sin t integration from 0 to t exponential minus s cos s ds minus cos of t integration from 0 to t exponential minus s sin of s ds here so as we know that exponential means integration integration of exponential minus x sin x is e with respect to x is equals to x minus of exponential minus x by 2 cos of x plus sin of x similarly as here by the direct result integration of exponential minus x cos x with respect to x is equals to exponential x minus of x by 2 into sin x minus cos of x here so if we substitute value here we get here this when f dot as here we have to find value of f star gt this one will be equals to sin of t into by substituting value of exponential minus s cos s ds is equals to this one which is equals to exponential minus s by 2 exponential sin of s minus of cos of s and we have to integrate this one by upper and lower limit 0 to t here minus cos of s and by substituting value here we can write it as here exponential minus of s divided by 2 with minus sign cos s plus sin of as here so by simplifying this one as here we can and apply lower end upper limit which is 0 which is 0 to t here now by simplifying this one we can write it as a sin t when we apply upper limit here this one will be exponential minus t by 2 sin t minus of cos t and we apply lower limit sin 0 equals to 0 and cos 0 equals to 1 here so this one will be plus exponential 0 this one equals to 1 here 1 divided by 2 into sin as here sin and sin t already given here so with minus 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 plus here this one will be cos of s when we apply upper limit here this one will be exponential minus t by 2 cos t plus sin t and when we apply lower limit here cos 0 equals to 1 so this one will be minus of with minus sign and 1 by 2 now by simplifying this one we can write it as here 
as here. This one will be exponential minus t. By simplifying this one, we can write it as here. Let us take exponential minus t by 2 as common. So, remaining term will be sine square t minus of sine t cos t. And remaining value is here 1 by 2 sine t. So, plus of 1 by 2 sine t remaining value here. Similarly, here if we take exponential minus t by 2 as common. So, remaining term will be plus of cos square t and plus of sine t cos t. And remaining term will be minus of 1 by 2 cos of t here. Here will be cos of t. As this one is cos of t here. So here is also cos of t. So this one will be cos of t here. So by simplifying this sine square theta plus cos square theta equals to 1. So this one is equals to here. This one equals to exponential minus t by 2 into this one is plus 1 here. And uh, sine t cos t cancel out with minus of sine t cos t. And plus as here is into with 1 plus 1 by 2 sine t minus of 1 by 2 cos of t here. So by simplifying this if we take 1 by 2 as common so remaining term will be sine t minus of cos t plus exponential minus t here. So now come to the option sine t minus cos t and plus exponential t. So plus exponential t sine t minus of cos t. So by comparing from option cos t with the minus sign and sine and exponential minus t with the plus sign. So, so here our option first exponential minus t plus sine t minus cos t with option id 1329 is correct answer here. Thanks for watching.